Well, in all fairness, that, that team has got some pretty good cards. Go on then, Sting Pig. Yes, we're live. Oh, I'm already live. Yeah, just... Oh, so, hey everyone! <laughs> you called him a Sting Pig. <laughs> Thanks. Well, you did grunt at me this morning. I know, but I don't know why I did. <laughs> it was me. Hey, Johnins, how are you? We're good, thank you. Well, I am anyway. You're good, Rob. Yeah, I'm like, I'm like a slug with a basketball. <laughs> slug with a basketball. Glad to hear you're good. Hey, Hayley! How are you? I'm not sure if Rob actually heard me. Claire? Are you going to say what? hello? Hello? To Hayley. To Hayley? Rob. Rob. <laughs> Behave you. Behave you. Is that the end of the sentence now? You can say whatever you like. I just thought you'd say hello to Hayley. I did? Didn't you just hear me? Yeah, but she's <laughs> being a bit silly. No, I'm not. I'm glad to hear you're good. We've missed you. I'm being a lot silly. I already said my panda. Yeah, hello, Pinky. What are you dressed as this time, Rob, so I know where you am? Motherboard. I say I'm this purple and blue stripey cupcake looking thing. We're expecting this to go bad, in all honesty. Yeah, we've That's really good. missed you, to be honest. Make yourself. Oh, well, it'll go bad when some idiot decides to just headbutt me in the back. It wasn't me, was it? Oh! Stop pushing me. It's really fun, Hayley, honestly. Um, I didn't think that I'd like it because of like the multiplayer aspect to it. Don't make me break out my Sean Connery. It is, yeah, we're both playing today. We're both on there. Oh, you bum holes. Qualified! Stop being so, hey, Alpha, are you okay too? Yay. I'll oh, you made it. it. Yeah, I qualified 40th. Oh. <laughs> I'm not sure if this is still on sale, but I managed to get it on sale for... £9, wasn't it, Rob, I think? Because I missed it when it was on Plus for free, yeah. so... I thought you got it on the PlayStation. Funny. <clears throat> Has it gone back up? It's not on sale anymore. So I don't know. Because I'd already got it, I know, so. Yeah. I would have a look for your Ailey, but I, I, I can't say because of, I've already bought it, so. But it would be really good. We do want to get like a game together for others to join as well, so we can all have a bit of fun. But nobody wants to join us. I'm sure people want to join, Rob. Stop pushing me. Stop hitting me. <laughs> Thank you for the me. follow, Debbie Jane. If I get annoyed today, right. Yeah. I'm not gonna actually get annoyed, I'm just gonna break out the Sean Connery. 
Okay, the Sean Connery. How are you? Because everything seems better with Sean Connery. I mean, just think. Would oh. you like to uh, suck on my nipples? Rav! <laughs> <laughs> oh, what am you doing, Nikki? Honestly. I think you're failing. Oh! 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 No! 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 Oh yeah. Finished. <laughs> I nearly made it there. I failed. I failed. Oh, which Discord's that, Debbie? Thank you for coming in. We really appreciate it. What are you doing? Oh no. You can do it, Rob. Go on. We're going to carry on watching this so we can see how Rob does. Um, but if Rob fails, we'll start a new game. Ter uh, terribly, in honesty, because <laughs> when I did this the other day, I, th I made it through by a fluke. Oh. <laughs> I have faith in you, Rob. Oh, Dystopia. Oh, thank you for coming in. Um, Dystopia is one of our good friends, to be honest. So we, we appreciate that. Thank you. I forgot we get um auto posted in 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 a discord I forgot that one he's pushing you off there no no he pushed me <laughs> oh come on you know please people you can you can write my Sean Connery <laughs> I think I uh, do a pretty good Sean Connery. <laughs> then again, I think everybody can. All we need to do is just. <sighs> also, um, because you haven't been here for a little bit, Hayley, we have new channel point rewards. Testicles. <laughs> for example, you can spend a thousand, and Rob will give you a completely random fact. You can also spend a thousand and we will purposely kill our character. Well, and first of all, why has it got to be me that gives the random fact? Because you're good with facts. By the way, Hayley said you sounded like the Grinch, Rob. Well, convenient. I am hairy, green and hairy. <laughs> um, Johnnins has redeemed a random fact. Okay, the, the only one I've actually got readily available <laughs> off the top of my head is Did you know the whales actually have fur? Like they have hair? I honestly couldn't believe that when you told me that. Honestly, Johnnins, we actually Googled it as well, and I couldn't believe it. Hey, Green Knight, you okay? They yeah. have itty bitty hair. No, because, you know, like, on a humpback whale, for example, they've got, like, them little bumps on the top of the nose. That's actually, like, hair follicles. Oh, I fell. So did I. <laughs> <laughs> Debbie! <laughs> 
<laughs> Debbie says she's from Wales. She doesn't have fur. Really? I thought that's where the hairy women come from. Right. <laughs> I'm just kidding. That's Stoke, innit? <laughs> Rav! <laughs> I will get to the chat in a second, I'm really sorry. I want to make sure there are no pigeons on this one because the pigeons usually get me. The pigeons? Yeah, the pigeons. Pigeons. Oh, look, it's you, Rav, hello! It's me. I just <laughs> fell! <laughs> that was terrible. <laughs> Excuse me! Push him off, Rob. Push him off. He pushed me. <laughs> oh, I don't know why. I don't know why I've, got, I've just got this... Uh, this need to Sean Connery today. <laughs> I say, honestly, I will get with the chat in a second. I'm really focusing on this now. I really want to do better. Again. <laughs> that, that's what it is, because have you noticed? I actually focus more when I'm, I'm, I'm trying to do impressions. I'm really bad at impressions, but I like to do them. I qualified. It's like these, you know. Right then, let me catch with the chat. Personal jokes that nobody else really gets, but you make yourself laugh. Right, thank you for the hydrate, Biggie. Um, Hayley's redeemed a would you rather this or that, Rob? Oh, Galaxy yeah, or Cadbury's? <laughs> I'll just answer the chat while you're thinking. Well, it, it depends, because okay. if it's just a plain the plane bar then Galaxy, I think. Because then Galaxy's like got a smoother taste to it. I think it really does. But I think if it's just in general, I think Cadbury's have got more variety. I quite like um like ripples and like I say just the normal Cadbury bars. I I think I do agree with that one. Um, Johnin says, why do they have fur? This is news to me. I've got so many questions now. <laughs> I need to rethink life itself. Honestly, I was I was shocked. I, I couldn't believe it myself, to be honest. I'm actually going to do with this or that, if I can do it. What do you need to do that for? So as I can make your answer. Okay, on, Would anybody else be open to answering these, this or that questions as well? Brownies or blondies? The cake, you know, the chocolate brownie or blondie. I will get to the story time, um, John Ince. This That's going to go very, very bad. If I fail, I will tell you a story. Right, first of all, I mean... The track record so far, with Binky in particular, you know, has, has liked the same kind of cereals as me. Without even knowing what I said, I picked exactly the same first best and second best. Yeah. You know, and so on. I actually would like to think that it'd agree with me in saying blonde isn't better. Yes, she did. Blondies are like a white chocolate brownie. Um, Debbie, that they're, they're actually really nice. Get off me! <laughs> oh, wrong one. This is uh, not going so well. Oh, this is a lap one, isn't it? Like, you've got to do two laps. That it is. Don't push me back again! I 
I will be there, don't worry everybody. I've I've got the story time. John in says um redeemed badges story time Rob. Yeah but don't forget you need three okay. things we've got on, don't worry. Okay, what's the three things? This will be interesting. I'll I'll have to tell you in a second once I've um, gone back to it. Oh, have you explained to everybody why it's Badger story time? No, I will explain. I will explain. That worked, Nicky, didn't it? Yay. I uh, qualified. I lost that one. Okay, right. Let's go back. Um, Green Knight also redeem this or that. Always be hot or always be cold. Cold, cold, cold. <laughs> cold, I think, to be honest as well. I say blondies are like a white chocolate brownie, and they're actually really nice. Um, Ailey said, "Told you we were twins, Rob." Yeah, except I'm, I'm the taller. Baller, less attractive. <laughs> um, right. The story time: a whale, an apple, and Coca-Cola. Now, Badger's story time. Honestly, Rob, there's sometimes when we're going to bed at night and we'll be lying there having a chat before we get to sleep, and Rob will oh. always, at, well, usually ask me for a story. No, hold on. This makes it sound bad. I think. You know, credit. Oh, with pardon me, I'm so sorry. Like accurate representations. In reality, it's normally when I'm overly tired and yeah. I don't actually really know what I'm saying or doing. Oh, I'm really sorry. <laughs> Go on, was you carrying on? No. Okay, right. Once upon a time, there uh, once was a whale named Fred. I got, I got saved and the thing shot me in the air. And then I landed on the sleepy slope. <laughs> there was once a whale whose name was Fred. And his favourite fruit was an apple. <laughs> this is already bad. <laughs> um, no, I beg to differ. This is already atrocious. <laughs> um, so we decided he was going to grow apple trees in his garden. Oh, don't tell me you watered it with magic Coca-Cola or something. How did you know? <laughs> How did you know? Why did you do that? No, you've ruined my story. No, it was ruined the moment you started telling it. But yeah, um... But then he got bored with just plain apples and he thought, I wonder if they would... if <laughs> they would taste different if we watered them with... <laughs> Oh, sorry, Miss Ray. <laughs> it's Badger's story time. <laughs> um, Johnnins has redeemed our channel point reward Badger's story time. And he's had, we've had to ask for three different items for me to make a story about. And it's Fred the whale, whose favourite fruit is apples. He grew an apple tree, but he got bored with them. So then he decided to water the tree with magic Coca-Cola. But he didn't realise at the time that it was magic. And then when the tree grew, it was a magic Coca-Cola apple tree. And <laughs> he juiced the apples, like, you know, like pureed the apples. 
to make Coca-Cola apple juice and <laughs> and Coca-Cola flavoured apple pie and it was like the best thing ever and he was so happy but nobody in the town would listen to what he got to say hold on, hold on he's a whale but he lives in a town yeah so he's a whale that lives on land yeah it's a magic whale <laughs> oh, so, so, is that your cop out answer? Like, if if it don't make sense, is well, it's magic. <laughs> I'm glad, Miss Rue. I'm glad. <laughs> I hope you've had a good day. Yes, you are anymore. <laughs> Miss Rue said my laugh makes the story even better. So. Yeah. Well, that's all <laughs> Green Knight yeah. says don't use logic to ruin the story rub thank you <laughs> right leg it Nicky leg it no you gotta carry on the story well basically he took the apples to the town and nobody cared about these special apples mm. Could you, could, could you keep it for a couple of minutes and if the another free bed comes available, just... Sorry, Karen. Uh, what was it? What did I say? Oh, I'm sorry, I'm ruining your fabulous story. Oh, no. <laughs> uh, what, what did I say, anyway? I've forgotten. Don't worry, it's rubbish, anyway. Yeah, nobody was interested in Fred's magic Coca-Cola apples. There's a reason. <laughs> So he decided that at some point he was going to make um, a special Coca-Cola apple pie, and there's a jump there, to, to trick the town into eating the apples. No, no, no. No! That was close. Yes, Fred has fur. <laughs> Does Fred have a family? No, he's a loner whale. But he really wants a family and he was hoping that these special magic apples would attract Frida, the whale that lived next door. I'm sorry, but that sounds almost like it might be his time. <laughs> no, Fred and Frida. <laughs> Is there a bit of sort of dirty whale insects going on? No. <laughs> I'm sure. I'm sure. Okay, I'm sorry, I'll, I'll stop interrupting. Um. So, it oh, made Frida, the whale next door, <clears throat> a Coca-Cola apple pie. Left it on her doorstep with a note that said that it was this special apple pie that he'd made especially for her because he'd fell in love with her. Oh, I'm watching you. Oh, sorry. Oh, I was actually controlling that. <laughs> Green Knight said must be humpback whales. Damn. I keep making the same mistake. Oh, well, that worked. Um. That didn't. So, Frida thought, well... This was my downfall, isn't it? I'll, I'll try this apple pie, see what it's like. It, w it would probably go better with custard, but she didn't have any custard, so she just had the apple pie on its own. Um, and she loved it, so she told the town about it, and everybody was Fred's friend, and they got together and had little whale babies. Okay. The end. If yeah. you don't take this wrong way, you know, listening to you telling the story, mm -hmm. I mean, now, now promise that you won't take this the wrong way. It makes me want to drink bleach. Ah, <laughs> uh, well. Jonin says, oh, so it became a big gangbang. 
Oh, and then what he starts. <laughs> I'm so sorry. <laughs> um, lot. Ailey said lots of sperm whales. <laughs> I, I think this talk's getting too dirty for me. Um, you know, it's, it's the kind of thing I don't think is meant for innocent ears. Alpha, we really do want to play Dying Light again. I'm just not sure when to do that yet because we, we planned to do um, Monster Hunter on Sunday. Did we? Oh, yeah. And, you know, and what am, so, where am I even going? I don't know, Rob. Where are you going? But we will. <laughs> so I'm, honestly, we, we both did actually really enjoy Dying Light. So we we will I'm, we will stream it again. It was really fun. I'm failing miserably. Honestly, oh. Miss Ray. <laughs> it. I usually make these stories when Rob's like. Overtired, and and he asks for a story. <laughs> Hayley said, "Rob, there's nothing innocent about you." Huh? Was was that why? <laughs> I'm I'm the sweetest, most innocent little being that you could wish to meet. And Green Knight said, "You sound like you have a cigar, lol." It's this Sean Connery impression. It is, yeah. I'm an expert Sean Connery impersonator. Not a lot of people know that. See that? That's a free random fact. <laughs> a free random fact. <laughs> oh, never mind, Rob. Damn it. Uh, what now? What? What? The, somebody says the best part of waking up is flodgers in your cup. What? I'm sorry, I don't understand that. Am I just being a bit silly? Or should I understand that? <laughs> What's flodgers? I uh, don't know. <laughs> Green Knight said Oh to Hayley, I concur. Last time he was talking about auditioning for a porn <laughs> I, I don't think Hayley had that story. Did she? Oh, yeah. oh it's a coffee brand. Oh I was oh sorry, yeah, I I didn't realise that. We we don't have that brand here. No, you know, we're we're just we're just these kind of weird people that like your standard Kenko and Nescafe. Tesco's own brand's quite nice. It's not, and I can prove it. You don't like coffee. Well, exactly. Hayley, that's real. <laughs> Is it me or does Nikki sound like a rapidly deflating balloon? <laughs> Ailey said, "Do fill me in." <laughs> if you insist. Oh gosh, Ailey, I can't breathe. <laughs> well, Nikki just said about when that. <laughs> well, I think I'm being ganged up on because people are claiming that I'm not. Yeah, sweet innocent young man. <laughs> And it says, like, one of the the chaps says, like, well, re just remember last time I was talking about auditioning for a porn film. <laughs> so Pinky said, do fill her in. <laughs> I've been waiting for it to say that. And then I said, on the story, I mean. Whoops. That that was a bit
bit bad terminology as well, isn't it? No, 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 Nicky, don't fall. No, 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 no. Oh, I fell. We. I will oh. catch up with chat. I'm focusing on this at the minute because the last time I did this, I didn't actually get past these logs. Like that. <clears throat> oh, you mean you're doing this bad and you're actually focusing? Yeah. Wow. You wouldn't believe it. Oh! I fell. <clears throat> no, Nicky. I will catch up, like say, with the chat, so I'll be there in a minute. Don't worry. I'm not ignoring anybody. Huh? Who's the one? That one. Hey, me, Nicky. Have you met it? Yes. Oh, well done. Thank you. <laughs> oh, I've already got a stuff back, so that's going to get a habit. <laughs> <laughs> no, Nicky, why did you even do that? <laughs> ah, right. Chat. What a <laughs> so, yeah, Ailey said filler in on the story, please. <laughs> Green Knight says, oh damn, Ailey, Rob's on the way. <laughs> yeah, I'm surprised you call right here hear me in my heavy breathing. <laughs> Rob. <laughs> Pinky, look out your window, you'll, you'll see me rapidly pulling it like a chimpanzee on stage. Rob! <laughs> you gobble, gobble. <laughs> So yet. Yeah. yeah um, well, again, like I, I, I want to stress, like I said the other day when I was explaining it the first time, it sounds like a joke, but it's an honest to god true story, right? When I was when I was first like you know like finished college and and so on, and I was first looking for work. Thank you, Ed. And I was first looking for work. Um, Rob, you fall in. One of the. Uh, one of the job advertisements that I've seen was. I th if I remember right as well, Nick, you were ex titled some like exciting new job opportunity. Yeah, I think it was. <laughs> and. Um, when you opened it up, that it was actually a job advert. You know, like for, on these things like Indeed and Read, Read and that, and and that. And kind of one, like the job sites. It was on one of them, and every category it was in, and it was advertising for people to star in adult films. <laughs> And what you have to do, that they'd give you an email address, and what they wanted you to do was email the address, so then they could send you a message through to tell you what evidence they needed. Evidence. <laughs> like, one one what, second. Morning, dirty world. How are you? What, Carry what on. Pictures, what pictures and so on that you would need to provide as evidence. And so, some of the uh, associated um, some of the associated uh, you know like skills was things along the lines of mustn't be camera shy. <laughs> Must be able to maintain an erection. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, but the point is, it was advertising for men and women. So, <laughs> you know, was 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 that a, a required skill for both? Possibly. The woman must be able to keep it hard, and the bloke must be able to stay hard. Hey, 
Alice said, good God, I wonder why my windows are covered in white stuff. That oh, was silly. Amazing. I thought you were already knew. I'm glad to hear you're doing well, Dirty World. I hope you enjoy your work. Probably not, I mean it is work. Well, I don't want to have to state the obvious there myself, but yeah. Salty. <clears throat> Go on, I got faith in you. Damn. No. I think that's something you should taste it. Tastes like bamboo. Brab. <laughs> what? Behave. This best not do to me what it did the other day. Oh, I thought you was going down then. No, stop. Please. Please, stop. <laughs> oh gosh. <laughs> Are you working in like an uh, office or outside or anything like that? <laughs> Only four of you qualified for that. Well, that's going to make the ending so much harder. <laughs> I like that cool, like, little King Mouse costume. It's just a cool, isn't it? Ah, I've, I've, I'm just going to give up now. No, no, don't give up, don't give up. Don't let him win. Doing delivery, so... I bet it's quite hot. I'm assuming you're driving a van. So I bet it's quite hot. No, he's probably on a skateboard. You never know. So you're against the robot -y looking one. Over there. Damn you. Other corner. No, no, no. Wrong way. Damn it. Oi. There, there. Right by ya. Oh, not you. Up top, always oh, got that's it. so bad. Wow. <clears throat> that oh, one's lit on. up again. Yeah, but what even flicked me into? What's honestly, me into I, I don't have a clue. In all honesty. Yeah, that. Oh no, sod off. That actually get in that when I was on it first. Oh uh, yeah. A bugger. It's it. when I'm actually landing on them first, and, <coughs> and clearly basically getting the point. I'm just, I'm just not supposed to win that, am I? It does not like it to be honest here. <laughs> Well, I hope you I mean, have a good day with your deliveries, Dirty World. I mean, I don't know if it was just me that was just seeing that then, but honestly, the, the three of them in a row, I actually stood on first, but it gave him the point. Yeah. Oh, I noticed, yeah. Oh, I can come out of that now, can't I? Oh, I've got to wait for it to go in now. Yeah, well, that's one thing, but... 
if I'm actually actively on the button first. Well, and you know, I mean, I understand. You know, they could say, yeah, well, th it could it could be down to lag, though, couldn't it? You know, like. But if the whole point of a game is to be online, you'd think that that establish the, the servers so that there would be no chance of that happening. Oh, look at that butterfly. I mean, that's like somebody, you know, like making a, a chess game and then only giving you like two pieces. Yeah. <clears throat> but still. <laughs> Back to Sean. <coughs> I'm sorry. So does anybody else play Four Guys that's in the chat at the minute? Me? Well, I mean, obviously, you're not in the chat, though, am you? You don't have your chat on, so... I'll put it on just so I can validate it. <laughs> <you know. laughs> I thought you might. <laughs> well, I know you play Fall Guys, Rob. You're actually playing it with me now. But I. You know, you know if I redeem something, I don't have to do it, do I? Yes, because we're playing together, so... Yeah, but if I'm redeeming it... Okay, okay, well if that's the case, why didn't you give a random fact as well then? Okay... Daisy, it is coming on the Xbox, isn't it? So, oh, what? I've just walked right off. Is that okay? Can I carry on now, or have I got to do it like because I'm supposed to die or something? Like, not get through. You've got to not get through. Oh, okay. So, I've just, I'll just continue to walk off the edge, then take a fall. <laughs> oh, he's, oh, no. It is really fun, Honesty Johnnings and Dirty World. It, it's really fun, isn't it? Oh, I flew. And I say, I don't think it should be long coming on the Xbox, should it rub from what I've seen on the. What? This coming onto the Xbox. They're then bringing it onto the Xbox, aren't they? I thought it was already on. No, I think it's on his Steam and PlayStation. Seriously, I thought it was already on Xbox. I'm not sure. Well, I'm not sure. Damn it. These people coming past me are probably thinking, what in the hell is they doing? Stop hitting me. <laughs> Stop hitting me. <laughs> Thank you for the other hydrate, Biggie. I'll get it in just a second. I wasn't even moving then. Thank you. Debbie says it's not on the Xbox yet, but it's meant to be coming the same time as the Switch. Oh, okay. Like I say, I, th I, I didn't realise, I thought, I thought it was. Um. Well, I think it's only from... I think, I, well... You know, I, th I think it's just my sort of... Not thinking, kind of thing. Yeah, probably. Um. <laughs> Did you get through, by the way? No. 
because them stupid clipper things, although I wasn't moving, it was just sliding me off. Oh, yeah. yeah. When I get a chance, um, what we're thinking of doing at some point is doing a... Um, like, say, a, a get-together um, playing with some friends and stuff. So while I'm here, if anybody would like to join a really friendly Discord channel... Um, we're just gamers. We, we've met really good friends in this group. I've just shared a Discord link in the chat. It, it's really good in there. Them, like I say, in the chat at the minute, John Innes is in there. Um, Dirty World's in there. Alpha's in there. Green Knight's in there. Miss Ree's in there. I can't remember who else is here, I'm really sorry. I'm not, that wouldn't invite me. You're invited, bro, I told you. Even though technically I'm, I'm, I'm half of this Badger Panda profile, I'm not invited. You are invited. Oh yeah, of course, yeah, John Inns as well. Honestly, I haven't played Animal Crossing properly for a, a while. I've been on just to log in really and that's it so i really need to get back onto that i'm hoping that there's some animal crossing news in the nintendo direct today so we'll see about that awesome debbie I say there's been some changes in there. We've um, just altered a few things around, and you know, different things like that. It's recently had a name change. So yeah, that they're lovely in there. Honestly, we want to make it like like a big sort of family, not just people. Do you know what I mean? So can I start calling him Uncle Gerald? You'll have to ask him that. Awesome, Hayley. Glad you're in there. Gotta start calling him Uncle Gerald. <laughs> Any idea when you're coming back to streaming yet, Hayley, or is it just we'll see? Uh. Oh, I shouldn't have done that. Hey. It worked. I didn't know so much. Stop hitting me. Please don't knock me into the fan or off there. Awesome, how's he doing? It's not bad that I'm actually excited for this summer house to see how it is and you know Move. <laughs> <laughs> I, I suppose we'll see less of you then won't we going on here? Why can't I get out of here? She didn't like us really. 
probably just me. No, we like you. Oh, I forgot you can still hear me. Yes, I qualified. I'd love to see some new pictures of him, Hayley, honestly. He's so adorable. And not much green knights. I've actually qualified for once. <laughs> if, if, you know, that's the news. Hayley says, no, you'll see more of her because I will be busy then. Is he even on? Rob. I'm not talking to myself. Rob. <laughs> it's very rare that I actually qualify more than twice. I gotta be honest. Oh, are you there? Rob, where are ya? What? Ah! <laughs> Swine. Oh, poop. This is so bad! No, don't knock me off! No! Oh, prestige. <laughs> still got your Sean Connery going, are you? Oh, it knocked me off again. If you can't trust Sean Connery, who can you trust? Do you agree? Well, I mean, I suppose. I mean, when when Sean Connery ever. Please left don't him. do this to me. See, see. Did you get through, Rob? Do you need to ask? You did, didn't you? Oh my gosh. Don't worry, Nikki, keep trying. You might actually make it past two rounds. I'll try. I'm trying. Oh, damn it. My track record with this isn't very good. I have faith in you, Rub. Yeah, I have faith in me, just not the other players. Because each time they end up just catching me at the last second. And why do I start right next to him? Oh, and I've, I've never been very good with being hit in the face with fruit. No. <laughs> While you're here, actually, Ailey, honestly... When you sent us those sweets and that badger and the panda, it was so lovely, honestly. We were really made up with that. It really made us smile so much. Well, that was luck. It was, wasn't it? 
They're actually on the desk at the like the the badger and the panda. They're on the desk. It's so lovely. The right size difference between me and Rob as well. Damn. <gasps> did you make it or did you fall? I made it so well. Awesome. The beam was just dragging me around. Oh. <laughs> the desk needs a bit of a sort so we can put them around. It's just I've got some little things like on the top with the speakers, like paperwork and little bits and bobs. Um, so I want to sort them out so they've got their own space because I love them. I, d I just don't want to do this. I did. I. I absolutely hate this level. I gotta be honest, I think it's one that I would get annoyed at as well. I don't think I've ever had to do this one yet, have I? I've not made it this far. I'm just finishing my drink, I'm sorry. On the top. I know. Did you see that then? I was actually standing on that. Yeah. <laughs> that was really nice. <laughs> That, that was actually really nice. Some of them kind of sweets we haven't had for a long time after we rub like the spice um sp um uh, the UFOs and things like that. Thank you for the lurk, baby Mickey. Hope you well. Up the top again if you can get up there. Well done. Risky, but I, was, I got a strategy there. It worked, so... Yeah, now it's just down to the last... the last level and I'll fail again. I bet you it's going to be one of them stupid... climb up this slippy slope or we pound your face with plums. <laughs> yeah, probably. Oh no, hexagons. Well. I can do this. It's just. time consuming. Yeah. I have faith in you, Rob. Oh, you anus. <laughs> oh, you anus. Okay, I'll take it back. I can't do this. <laughs> You'll do good. I got faith. I don't mind as long as I'm not the first one eliminated. Well, you, you won't be the first any time now anyway, so... Somebody's already gone. Trying to keep my focus for him so as I'm not bothering him too much with noise. <laughs> 
some are still up, so good luck with that. Sarah, thank you for raiding. Oh, you're amazing. Thank you. Hope your birthday stream went well. Let's give you a shout out for your raid. Hey, Sian, you okay too? That was like half a second. <laughs> Damn it. No worries, Johnnins. Hope you have a great day. Sarah said hi, Rob. Hey, Ash. Thank hi, you for man. the sub. We've also got, are you listening? Ash and Sian as well. Oh, oh, well, first of all, hi, Looney. Happy birthday. Another year more mental. <laughs> <laughs> Self selfish hogging up all those birthdays, if you ask me. Oh, Rob. <laughs> are you even ready? Yeah. Hello, Ash person. You know Ash, obviously. Yeah, I was just going to say th um, thanks again for for mentioning that um, Rocksmith Plus. It's signed up, so hopefully it can try the beta. Yeah, I think I'm definitely going to subscribe to it when it finally comes out. And uh, hello to the sexy little Smurf. There you go. <laughs> <laughs> Hope you're all well. Well, uh, and me, because I, I wanted to try and to try and cheer. Cyan, did you say? Cyan. Cyan. Oh. Oh, because she looks a little blue. A little blue, <laughs> bro. <Get it. laughs> oh, what's mom want now? <laughs> Sarah says you didn't say Christmas tree. <laughs> no, because she's she's a Smurf now. I may have said Christmas tree, but she's kept the sexy. <laughs> oh gosh. <laughs> I will read that in a second, Green Knight. I... That's a long one to read. I will read it, I promise. Stop pushing me. Rub. What? What? You and your Sean Connery. <laughs> Don't fall, Nikki. You stupid idiot. See, I know you told us to play this before. You pushed me off, you stupid shark. Damn it. I'm, yeah, like I said, I, I know you told us about playing this before, and then we didn't get around to it. And then, bang. <laughs> but then, it was on off. Oh! <laughs> the other day. Oh, for pity's sake, you stupid idiot. <laughs> oh, I'm just I'm just gonna fail, honestly. Um Yeah well our adoring fans love consistency. Yes, Vicky, go on, go on. Right, I'm through. Sense. I'm not very good. Oh, like that, like that. Who even just jumps down the hole like that? You. It's a quirk. Oh, 
Oh, you... <laughs> Are you watching me? You've already made it through, haven't you? I am, yeah. Nikki, what would you do if I reported you? Please don't report me. <laughs> what would you report me for? I don't know. Depends on what the options come from. <laughs> Loud noises. <laughs> yeah, um, we've really enjoyed playing this and soon we would like to not fall off to see if we can get a group game together yeah can i ask this ask what sexy smurf will you come and play with me no nikki <sighs> right. I, think, I think it would be good to get your hands in on it Oh, Rob. Right, I'm, okay. I'm reading this now, okay. um, Green Knight. Random question. Since you're all from the UK, do you find it offensive when Americans say, I love your accent? I ask because I had a sociology professor that, asking, that said that asking that is offensive since the English language was established in England. I don't find it offensive. We've all, like, wherever we are in the country or in the world, like, even with America... Everybody has got a different accent, haven't they? So I don't find it offensive at all. Yeah, stemming from the really, really posh, you know, like Chelsea and, you know, them kind of parts of London. Yeah. Um, to oh, mid-range places, it, yeah. say, like Newcastle or, you know, the Midland, like Wolverhampton, Birmingham. Down to the lower end of the scale, like Stoke and. Right. <laughs> I've, no. I've never even thought that somebody saying that somebody likes your accent is is offensive at all. I've never even thought that at all. I've got to be honest. If you ask me, it's part of the modern the modern society that. They've got to find a fence in everything, even if there is none. As far as I'm concerned. You just nearly met that, didn't you? Oh no, you've got to get seven points. No, 15 points, sorry. Oh, what have you already done? No, I went, I didn't go through. Oh. We're watching you. Yeah, I'm being atrocious at the minute, I don't know if you can tell. Better than I could do. Do you remember that once when I got none? Hey. Come Let on, you just gotta get three more points. No. They're gonna beat me. I just need one, I just need one, I just need one. Well done, last one to qualify. That was close. That's what I thought, but this guy was adamant about it. His power points were messy AF, so that's the, as that, lot. No, I mean... I've got to be honest. It's... Hearing most things, like... People saying about, you know, this, this could be offensive, that could be offensive. I don't understand it anyway, I mean... I'll, I'll joke about almost anything because at the end of the day, like, you know, a joke's a joke. I also, it's like when you hear a lot of people recently saying about, I mean, controversial, I suppose, topic if anybody might think so, but, um, you know, I hear like the, the racism, oh, here we go, the racism aspect that's been going on a lot lately. I mean, I am fully anti-racist. Um, my best mate, my best mate all through school, um, was a black lad, Troy. Troy was amazing. In all honesty, he was, you know, you know, he basically he'd make he'd make jokes himself about about his his family, like he, his mom with a proper sort of, because his mom had got like a proper Jamaican accent. Literally, that was from Jamaica, like. Um, 
And I'd, I'd make jokes about basically being a white lad and, you know, even negative things about being a white person. Do you know what I mean? Like, so. But at the same time, it's, it's like when, when a lot of people recently you've seen, they've been saying things like, you know, I find it offensive when people say, like, where are you from? I don't understand why. Because it's like, if somebody was to say to me, I mean, you hear my voice, you probably assume I'm a white dude. You don't know. But if so, if you was to say to me, like, where am you from? Asking in terms of, like, Britain. Well... What, what's offensive about that? Saying, saying about somebody's accent or ways, ways they speak, words they say, like, why is it an offence to ask questions and try to get to know things about people? You know what I mean? Like, so I, I, I just don't understand how anybody could take offence at it, in all honesty. That's it, everybody yeah. quiet. Like, yeah. Are you ready? Yeah, well. See, see, this is another reason why I normally just say stupid things, because when I actually say something on a serious note, people just seem to just go quiet. Oh, I was, I'm listening. Green Knight says true, and it depends on the context and the manner of how they're asking, doesn't it? Well, precisely. I mean, if if if, for example, an American was say, you know, reference me as a limey or something like that, then I'd I'd be offended by that because, you know. I'm, you know, understand. I'm, I'm saying this in a making the point kind of way. Like, you know, if like if I was to say to you, like, well, what type of Yankee am ya? That's offensive. If I was to say, you know, like, whereabouts in America are you from? And then, you know, like asking you follow-up questions about what it's like in your area, or it's getting to know people and getting to know like. About where they're from, like the, the learning, exactly. basically, isn't it? I do like to like to learn about people. I say in like in the group that we're in, like with Green Knight and Gerald and stuff like that. Well, people like that. Uncle Gerald. Uncle Gerald. <laughs> I've I've learnt a lot about different places and you know different things. Yeah, but you're from Bilston. It's only been over the last ten years you've learnt to speak properly. Instead of just a I'm usually bad at this one. And snarls. I I forgot to actually ask Green Knight. Do you actually know who we were on about when we say Gerald? I'm not sure if you if you know that. Oh, you can actually get up that side. I didn't know you could get up the side. I'll just wait for these, in all honesty. No, don't fall! Just fall, you stupid. <laughs> no idea why we call him Gerald, though. When we played um, Destiny, and he joined us on Destiny, 
um, Rob asked him what his name was, and it was just like, is it like, it says it, it sounded like a Gerald. Uh, so he's just took that nickname now, and if Rob doesn't call him Gerald, he's like, where's my Gerald? <laughs> Come on, Nicky, come on. I have to get used to being called Unky Gerald. <laughs> I'll tell him later. <laughs> did you make it through, by the way? I think you did, didn't you? Yeah. Yeah, because I'm not watching you, so. No, no, I'm not watching a snowman. <laughs> I was watching a shark. I think it was like sounded like Gerald or something like that. Mm. No, um, because he just because he'd been in the streams a few times and you. You know, um, you asked him what he wanted us to call him, whether like Dustin or Dustin Orbit or, and I, and I just said, well, I just took a random guess on his name. It was Klaus. Klaus and far. Yeah, well, I guessed it was a name. It's close enough. Well, at least you got <laughs> the E in it in the right place. Yeah, exactly. I mean, I, I could have called him up like R two D two or something. Yeah, so at least I actually. I'm, I'm just trying to justify myself here. So. Oh, okay. <laughs> Sarah, if you're still here, how did the rest of your stream go? I know, I know I missed. Did you start Planet Coaster? Hey, stop pushing me. I'm glad it went well. I wish I could have stayed longer, like, both times. Um, battery played a part in that. I did, I'd already gone then, hadn't I? Well, I'm glad you've had a good birthday though, anyway. I oh, know. On to your 70s now, innit? I mean... 80s? <laughs> oh, 90s? I'm glad I got me duck to work. <laughs> but honestly, Ellie, I've got Planet Coaster. I haven't played it yet. But I've got Planet Zoo as well. That I've been playing a little bit. But I did try Planet Coaster. Oh, I've just spat on my phone, sorry. I have got I have played Planet Coaster on the Xbox, but I'm not really I don't really like the controls of the controller. But on the consoles for the games, I prefer it for things like The Sims and like Roller Coaster and things like that. I like mouse controls. Um. And me, except for when they bite. <laughs> I will definitely play it at some time, Sarah. Honestly, I really need to. Which way around does this go? That way. Get off me. I just got hit in the face with a strawberry. Shoot you. I'm up. Oh, I've gone. Stop. Stop. I've got um, Planet Coaster with the Ghostbusters expansion, like on a deal on Steam. So I'm looking forward to trying that. Da 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 Tomato. I think with the controls with like the Xbox it just feels weird, doesn't it? I didn't like it. I think it feels the same, whatever I mean. Obviously if 
Like the way Pinky was talking dirty earlier, I mean, it feels a bit different then. I suppose it's. <laughs> you know I'm better than you. No. Oh, did you make it through? No, I didn't, no. I got knocked out. I think I was second to be knocked out. Green Knight said, Sean Connery plus Rob equals Rob Seanery. Lol. <laughs> Sean Robbery. <laughs> Sean Robbery. <laughs> but yeah, did I finish my conversation about like getting a game together of this? No, I, I asked I asked the smell if, if she'd be willing to come and play with me. Oh, you are so bad. I missed what happened, <sighs> I'm sorry. No. <laughs> Something just hit me, threw, threw me off the platform. Yeah. But I still qualified. <laughs> but was she the last one so we didn't actually associate that you'd been knocked off? Like somebody had fell before you. So somebody must have gone in literally like half a second before I did. Yeah. Yeah, no, I've I've got to I've got to stop that voice because in all honesty, um, let's be honest, Nikki, you know what I'm like. It gets a habit. I know. I know it does, and then it gets annoying, and then you may get a a punch in the leg or something. I'm watching you now, Rev. <laughs> you see? It's weird. It's weird with me, isn't it? Like... I don't really get addicted to things. Other than, like... Women and... Food and... <laughs> women and food. You know, video games and... But I get addicted to um, habitual words and things. Like with hostel and Oli. <laughs> yeah, that's because Oli in hostel is a legend. I've been on. Animal Crossing, Hayley, but I haven't properly played. I just did a quick tidy up, like, of the weeds. And put on to order, like, some of the um, seasonal stuff. But I, I haven't properly played it for a, a bit now. I haven't even finished Rob's Island. both having good days at work though I don't know who you are <laughs> but I'm Sean Connery <laughs> bro stop it and, <laughs> and usually this would be uh, Liam Neeson but I have a certain set of skills <laughs> oh gosh I was putting the next one straight on, by the way. Most of them involve idiocy and penis. <laughs> Sometimes my testicles. Rev. <laughs> I will find you. And probably just stare at you through the window. Oh! Green Knight has done us a would you rather this or that. I'll go on then. This will be good. Right, he's, he's asked if we can give an explanation as to why. 
be in jail for five years or be in a coma for a decade? Coma. Go on then. Well, yeah, be in jail for five years, you know, then you're free for five years compared to a coma for 10 years. But I think for me, there's, there's a lot of things that that really just outdo the jail term. Number one, yeah, it might be 10 years, but think about it. You wake up. I mean, look at look at the state of the world now. Everybody's coughing and sneezing and getting angry at people for not wearing a mask. Yeah? You can't get your hands on a PlayStation 5. By that time, it's probably PlayStation 7. Oh. Yeah, but at least you can get your hands on a 5 and you've missed all them games, so... <laughs> It'd be a legacy console, it'd be cheap. Second of all, right, think about how many other new things would be... Oh, poop. ...implemented into the world. You know. Um, no, 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 no! Oh. Uh, by then, my... F my phone contract would have already been paid. I can just look for getting a brand new phone and obviously with all the new technology about. Yeah. Rev, you know if you're like in a coma? Yeah. Who is then going to be paying your phone contract? <laughs> Me? You. Exactly. So I got to worry about it, have I? Yeah, and, and there's, there's another more obvious side to the coma no! thing. Doc, I found in general doctors and nurses tend to be a little less rapey than prisoners. So my my bungalow will be a bit safer. Oh gosh. And even if a doctor did decide to have his way with me, or her way, preferably, I wouldn't even know about it. Plus, there's, there's less like the only thing that doctors would normally stab you with is needles. You know, I mean, that that by far beats like filed down toothbrushes and stuff like that. So I just feel like the coma would be safer. Well, I've got to be honest, I probably would have said the jail because I know this is going to sound a bit silly, but if I'm in a coma, I don't know what's going on in the world. Whereas if I'm in jail, I could still know what's going on. Like, I can still... So, so you're not know. in this. In that, if what, what you're saying is your nosiness and, ne and the need to know what's going on. Yeah. Far outweighs the risk of being beaten up, stabbed, assaulted in more ways than one. Well, I'll tell you what, Nikki, you go to prison, I'll take the coma. <laughs> Well, you know. In all fairness, the chances are um, you'd probably be in prison for putting me in a coma. Probably. You'd probably finally have ended up getting sick of me. I've got to be honest, I, I love these, uh, these all that questions. The weirder, the better for me. Yeah, like that one that you asked me the other day when I was streaming Sushima. Which one? The one where it turned out you'd rather be your mom's dildo. No, not that one. Oh. Oh, you mean you'd rather you'd rather nibble on Chris Hemsworth's poopy bottom <laughs> than than lick Donald Trump's scrotum once. Yeah. Wouldn't everyone? Well, no, because first of all, Donald Trump might actually pay you. Second of all, it's one lick compared to nibbling a pooped up bottom. Who's Chris Hemsworth? 
Yeah, but do you realise how disgusting that is? Just because it's Chris Hemsworth, you'd, you'd, you'd lick his poo. That's just sick. <laughs> I'll take the chance. Oh! Ailey! <laughs> Ailey's redeemed to this or that. Is what? this for me or for Rob or both? I will ask you when I get confirmation. First time ever I've qualified for that. Both, oh crap. <laughs> Hayley said top or bottom sexy time and why? When you say top or bottom, do you mean like, you know, whether you're lying down or on top, or do you mean like top mouth or bottom mouth? No, I think she means like lying down or... Really, oh my gosh. Uh, what does behind count? Gosh! So I prefer that you can get a better angle. Better. Oh you know my what? gosh! You know what? I'm I'm all right. I'm all right, however. I can I can get a good bit of power and depth from all of it. Oh my gosh! But I, just for the purpose of the question, I'd say I'd say top. Why? Because then I can really pound your head. Oh my God! <laughs> well. Well. Okay. Well. Anybody's heading to the headboard then? Excuse me? Don't do this to me again. I just fell right off the edge. <laughs> Hayley said doggy style, hey. Green Knight no. says... Mm -hmm. Panda style. Oh, Panda no. style. Green Knight says hot damn rub. Hayley said, wow, Rob, you're a monster. Green Knight said, we got Daddy Rob in the house. Oh, yeah. <laughs> oh, you. Well, do I really have to answer this question? Yeah. Hey, well, I've answered it, so... I can answer it for her, if you want. <laughs> uh, I prefer to just lie there and wait for entry. <laughs> you know, like... A, a really old, forgotten basketball net. Well, thanks. Thanks for that description. Like a, an old, overgrown well. Just with more fungus. <laughs> well, Green Knight said to Hayley, OMG LMAO. Because Hayley said, Poor Nikki, I bet her hole hurts from all that pounding. No, get, get me right. I mean, y you should know, Pinky. Like, I mean, I know you dreamt about it. Um, I've, I might have the power there. 
but I do it in a way so as it, it doesn't just rub raw and you know. I don't, I don't, how, how would I explain it? Kind of like having a really satisfying hot dog. What? Well, like, or, or you know, like a nice, a nice warm cup of tea on a cold morning. I'll give you that kind of feeling. You know. I like a good copper. I'm not sure whether people actually like remember or anything, but at the minute, Rob is actually sitting next to his dad. And what's wrong with her? Same stuff that you've just said. We actually had crumpets for breakfast this morning, Green Knight, actually. Wow, power slamming. <laughs> oh, you say about me, you know, sitting next to Dad. I mean, it's not the kind of thing that is really that fun to think. You do remember that by definition of him being my dad. That does actually mean that basically, I mean, for me, a sickening thought, but Dad has actually done a bit of pork da, 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 da. So, you know. <laughs> I'm sorry, I've just caught up with a chat. Hayley said, lies there and says, is it in yet? Cobweb sailing, oh gosh. <laughs> Green Knight says, Rob's dad, and then put, like, a, a quote. That's my boy. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> and Hayley said, sorry, Mick. I had a dad who basically be laughing his tits off. <laughs> laughing his tits off. Well, well, Pinky's just uh, just says to Nikki like about what is the cobwebs, and Nikki just lies there. No, and no, Haley's is like cobwebs. I says. Oh, oh, Pinky's is like cobwebs. Haley says mine's like cobwebs that I have to dust away every month. <laughs> well, I don't know if you've, I don't know if you know this, but basically. I do have the moustache, because I have a beard as well. Oh, right. Rob. I could use it like a broom if you want me to, uh... Yeah. Rob. Just get into the dirty spots you call get yourself. Rob. Ailey's laughing at that. <laughs> Not as though it might be re might necessarily be relevant. I mean, depends on whether you want to think it relevant yourself. My tongue is a fair few inches long. Rob! <laughs> right. What? I've got the memory of a sieve, so... Let's just see if we can get this right. No, you are your donkey. I always have to rely on you to do this for me. Right. Grape, apples are next to me. Well, I wanna... Where am you? Next grape. corner, yeah. And the two either side are apple. Or whatever. It... Don't you dare push me off there, you stupid alien. Apple. Well, I'll join. Right, bananas either side, grape, 
orange and cherry. You got banana, yeah. Banana, watermelon, orange, banana. I'm just going to follow you. Oh, uh, I can't remember what's what. Banana, banana, watermelon, apple. On me. Hold it. Qualified. I was trying to push her off there. You was trying to push me off? No. You just said it? Yeah, well, it's childish banter, that's all. Childish banter. Okay, I was trying to push you off. <laughs> At the point. <laughs> oh, I forgot. I was in, like, the MVP lounge because, um,. It was our name that was picked on the thing. I did. I didn't do too bad on this one, just so. Hopefully, we'll do all right again. And besides, I like that striped costume with a bow. I want it. I feel like I should um, just finish what I was saying earlier, by the way. What? I mean, did you know I am known as Mr. Subway? But you never Who's told you that? <laughs> the old Megan or two. Excuse me. <laughs> um, Don't even. Does she like Subway? No. It's because I take ages to arrive and then it's very disappointing. <laughs> Bruh, honestly. <laughs> no, no, that's because it's all bread, no meat. Sarah, you're going to enjoy your birthday with your mom. See you, Sian, too. Hope you both have a great day. Yeah. Thank you for popping in and for the raid, Sarah. Yeah, bye, really appreciate bye, it. Bye, little Smurf. <laughs> Qualified. Just about. Oh yeah, I keep forgetting to do that. I will do it. Do what? Sorry. Alice says about the bland badger and the panda on the Amazon wish list. Now we've got them. Oh yeah. They're so cute. Honestly, I really like them. That. I can um, I can hide away from you now. Why? All I, to do, all I have to do is sit next to that, and you are tell the difference. Oh, I know, yeah. Well, no. I, suppose, I suppose, except for the fact that, like, I'm like probably. Five foot and eight inch bigger than it, but that's the point. <laughs> it's adorable, honestly. Now, what, sorry? 
No, it's okay. It doesn't matter. I was just gonna say, if I fail this, when I've gotta go and have a wee. No, 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 no. Hello. Hello. Oops, oops. This full guy is not ready yet. <laughs> oh, that's just... Oh, come on! <laughs> well, that was a stroke of luck, wasn't it? Qualifies. It did the same to me on that last platform again. Oh. You definitely do, Eddie. That is a really cute emote, honestly. What? So they need to find a unicorn plushie like her emote. Green Knight says, What other voice impressions can you do, Rub? Mate, it's only you, just get over the line. Sorry, carry on. I don't know if you noticed, but I'm not really that great with uh, the Sean Connery impression. <laughs> <laughs> Alice says you can do sexy waffles. Right. Do you, you want it? Oh, I'm I'm really good at, at one impression. Do you want to hear it? Yeah. You're actually saying nothing. Yeah, no. I was impersonating too in common. Rob. <laughs> Why am I so bad? Um. <laughs> I can do a good Penelope Cruise. You wish. Hey, what you want about wish? I want about my dreams. Rob. Well, I said it was good.
Well, I'm about to fail miserably. Okay. Smile. I smiled. So then you are be failing miserably. Green Knight says, make the weirdest noise you can. It'll take that as an impression. Okay. <laughs> Breathe. <laughs> That's me. He's Mickey laughing. <laughs> See? <laughs> See, you can't tell the difference now, can you? He just said that was Nikki, eh? lol. See, exactly that. That's how good of an impression it was. <laughs> Alright, you know what else? I'm just gonna I'm just gonna say one thing and it, this might seem a bit random to people. But Nikki. Yeah. Dog testicles. <laughs> I'm really sorry. I've really just got to go and have a wee. I'm really sorry. I will be back. Rob's here. He'll chat. Have you got the chat on for people talking? No. Do you think you should? No. Well, I think you should. Hayley says, that bloody ice cream van, why does it sound like it belongs in Five Nights at Freddy's? No. I, don't, I don't know if it's just me, but if anything, that ice cream van sounds like it belongs in Jimmy Sal's Guide to Pedophiling. <laughs> I can't say that word, Ailey, that's a naughty one. <laughs> Green Note said Nikki does a great impression of a deflating balloon. <laughs> Thank you. I don't know whether to buy that butterfly nameplate. I really feel like I want to. And Hayley says, come on now, we need to hear that story. I bet it's the dog's testicles. Oh, what, what story did the... about the, the dog? Yeah. Well, I'll oh, just no, go and have a wee, you tell him about the dog. No, all, all it was was like... Um, was watch, I don't know if you've ever heard of it. A program called... Ridiculousness. Um, I mean, I I got the chat open, so I don't know if anybody's answering. But um, a program called Ridiculousness is like, you know, just funny sort of internet videos hosted by Rob Deerdeck. You know, it's, and one of the videos on it, it was like a dog, a male dog, standing at the top of the some stairs. And you know, when dogs like slide down the stairs on their belly, it, it did that, except its testicles was like pulled up. So every step it was, go it was going down, the testicles was being pressed between the step and his bum. And it was on every step and that was just like, like on every single step it was... Well, it was quite a sight, that's all I can say. Right, I'm back. I also bought my Yorkie. No.
Oh, yeah, that, that, that's what that word is. <laughs> Testicles. Did you tell the whole story? Yeah. Okay. Can you hear me eating this chocolate? Okay, I'm yeah. I'm sorry. Honestly, it was so funny. Just to see that pop up next on the videos, it was literally so funny. I'll have to try and find it and message it, you really, honestly. Oh, bless him. You'll start seeing that soon. <laughs> well, you know, when the... Did that drop? Do they drop on a, on a dog? Oh, but I suppose they'd drop, wouldn't they? Are you ready? Hold on. Oh. Hold on. Um. Oh, how do you, how do you share things? The YouTube app now. There should be a button that says share and then copy link or whatever, or it should come up to share. Also, Hayley, I haven't actually told you yet. We featured in a YouTube jump scare compilation. The laugh made it. Right. Oh, you've just um, sent the link. Yeah, Pinky, I've just sent the link in uh, in the messenger. I will also copy. Is this for that dog video? Yeah. Yeah. I will also pop it in the Discord meme section, Green Knight, if you want to have a laugh. Meme. Posted. Have you watched it? I mean, as as another male, <clears throat> it's it's painful to see. <laughs> it's so funny. Thank you for the follow, Green Fluffy Bird. That means a lot. Thank you. How are you? Hydrate, let me get it. Rob, got your drink. I got my Vimto. Thank you for Hi. the hydrate. Say again. Well, for some reason, I said I've actively just had a drink. Oh. <laughs> I'm turning into Father Jack. <clears throat> Thank. Honestly, Ali, I think if I was to see that in real life, I probably would have fell down the stairs with laughter, in honesty. I really want the unicorn head. Okay, please don't say that too often. That sounded weird, didn't it? Really did. I mean, I like the the. I didn't know he was into bestiality. 
now. I mean, the, the costume unicorn. I should have just fell down there in the first place, let's be honest, Nicky. I just pushed me off there, bro. Could be certain. No one gets me about this, this game at times. What's that? It's like. Ah, oh, screw physics. Yeah. So it's like screw physics, you know, like a ramp is shooting up, gonna propel you, but because you wasn't actively on it when it first initiated, it's just gonna slide you off the edge. Yeah. <clears throat> today, other days I've failed miserably. <laughs> I was going to say, I didn't make it through, so... <laughs> Pardon me again, sorry. But yeah, definitely, Ali, I think you should get this, and then you can join um, a group game. One of the days it would be awesome. Yeah, you could come and play with me again. Yeah. <laughs> I've, I've missed you playing with me. We have missed you. You can do it, Rob. <laughs> I was saying to Rob um, last night, at the end of this month, it's a uh, literal sixth month streaming, like six months since we started streaming and I don't know stream anniversary that's a good one there you go and I'm not sure I'll say I'm not sure whether we should like plan something special like a certain so long of a stream or you know something like that I'm not sure what to do yet well done, qualify first. <laughs> Face cam reveal, we're really not comfortable with camera at the minute, green noise. I think even still for now, it, it it's something that I don't think I I'd personally be very comfortable with right yet. Quite yet, I should have said. Um, I, I can give you an idea of my face. Just imagine a three-quarter inflated basketball that had been dropped in mould. Rob. <laughs> that's not your face. I told you I like your face. Yeah, but you also like McFly. 
So. There was nothing wrong with because McFly. It calls your taste into question, didn't it, really? I mean, you watch these Real Housewives programs, so it does call your taste into question. There's nothing wrong with Real Housewives either. There really is. <laughs> there is not. Honestly, Green Knight, I think if if I was comfortable, or if we was both comfortable, we would probably consider that. But I think it's going to take us a little bit, I think, to be comfortable with actually seeing us on the camera. If you know what I mean. Yeah. I Green Knight, no sorry, carry on. You know, if it's been raining and there's a particularly deep reflective puddle, if I look down, I, I almost poop because I get that scared. Oh, Rob. Green Knight says Rob is 10 out of 10 handsome Squidward. Uh, yeah, one then. <laughs> and Hayley says they're both beautiful inside and out. Coming from somebody that. Am you going by my sort of my natural brothers, like my other panda brethren? Right, like, you know what you do. What? We should. <laughs> we should. We should try to do a bit of everything. What do you mean, a bit of everything? Well, I mean, I know. I ain't gonna say as in, I should do that, but... You know, like... As an example, you know the way I said about thinking of maybe streaming some art off the iPad if people would be interested? Yeah. Um, or bass playing, or something like that. You should do something like that. Like uh, me do an individual thing in the in the early afternoon or in the morning even. Yeah. Then we should do something collectively together in the afternoon, and then you should do something of like the evening when I get there with Hutch. Yeah, like a. Uh... Be... Oh, yeah. Should be something like. Just, that would just be really, really fun or funny for people. Like Super Meat Boy. Oh gosh, Super Meat Boy. I do feel quite compelled to play that. Damn it. We do watch some anime Green Knight. Um, it's been a while. Would you class like Pokemon as an anime as that? Because we do like Pokemon. But the main one that we watch is... <laughs> Pokemon yeah. is an anime. Yeah, but well, that's what I mean. I just wondered if like Green Knight would class that or if they'd have... Like, he's on about more of, like, Naruto, things like that. Anime is anime. And yeah, Pokemon yeah. Is anime. Well, we watch Pokemon still. We, oh, as well, you know. Oh, it's sure amazing. And we watch One Piece. Rob got me into One Piece. Um, but my sister is the one that's into all the anime. She likes quite a lot. She went to the cinema to watch one by herself the other day. I can't remember what she said it was called, in all honesty, but... She's the one to go to about animes. How about you? <laughs> right, I'm gonna be the loser that just goes. And I literally just went. <laughs> Oh, and I followed that idiot off. Tactics, tactics, tactics. Don't push me. Stop pushing.
potion me. Oh, come on, Rev. Well done. should do we should do like a, a rage day rage day <laughs> yeah because then what we should do like I should play a game that will make me angry you know what I'll because I'll, I've never actually played it properly like at all I'll see about getting something like Dark Souls and for a couple of hours in the morning or something, I'll play a couple of hours of Dark Souls. Yeah. You know, completely inexperienced with that game. Played Bloodborne but, and Demon Souls a little bit. But not Dark Souls. And then we can have like get some PvP games ready. Like like this, for example, like doing some Fall Guys. Is that what you mean or? Well I was thinking more so like you and me one V one in on like Call of Duty or Oh right, yeah. yeah. Fights. No worries, Hayley. Um, just let me know when you're gonna head off. Um, you gotta eat, but that does sound really nice. Pizza and fries from the chippy, and a tango ice blast. Ooh, I haven't had a tango ice blast in ages. I don't think we've got rust green night. I mean, I know of that game, but no, I've, I definitely ain't got it, because, um, like I say, I know of it, and in all honesty, I know that it ain't the living hell out of me. Oh, I can't remember which one Rust is, in all honesty. Go on, go on. Can you not breathe like that though, Rob, please? It sounds really weird over the like the earphones. <laughs> I I geometry dash. No, no, you idiot. Rob. You did really well, though, I'll be honest. <laughs> Green Knight says deep breaths into the mic, please. <sighs> Rob, that's a bit much. <laughs> Green Knight says, still waiting on the Rob ASMR. <laughs> Alia says, he sounds like he's jerking one off. <laughs> Green Knight says, keep going. <laughs> yeah, it's better, especially for you, Pinky. I'll have to get a bucket though, I'll fill it up for you. Oh, sure. 
I'll behave you. <laughs> just do me one favour, Rob, seriously. For Green Knight, do you do your sexy waffles? I'm sure he'll enjoy that. Like your ASMR sexy waffles. Yeah, but that was that sexy waffles was just one of these. I mean, I'll try, but it was one of these off the off the cuff kind of. It's the first thing I could think. I mean, let's let's put this trust Pinky to think of sexy waffles. You know, like anybody else was thinking, you know, do it in a German accent or you know, say it in Japanese or not Pinky now. Gotta be sexy waffles. The other first I could think of was just waffles, and that was it. That's, yeah. I had to do the other one because you know the orgasm in waffles. That was no, that was a bit much. Alice said, "Just fill my bucket instead." <laughs> I think I think I'm uh, I think I'm finally getting through to Pinky. It says, it says to just fill her bucket instead. <laughs> yeah, but is, is that what? Do you mean like poop? Do you mean like your mouthy mouth, or sort of like the furry mouth? Rub. What? I just, I just need to know. Yeah, it's just... <laughs> so, so now where there's tech protection. <laughs> I'm only joking, I'll have techno. <laughs> as, any, just... as any good responsible adult knows, protection just ruins the feeling. <laughs> Now that's a lesson to learn in school, kids. I only said both buckets. They're both big enough. Hey, I don't know. I don't know if you, uh... I don't know how to call this. Have you ever tried to swallow a baseball bat? Because that's what it... Excuse me. Loose me. <laughs> Gotta be bare back, Ailey says. <laughs> no. <laughs> that wasn't a note to Pinky, by the way. Oh. What was that a note to? Well, Dad just asked if you're ever going to be close to the final. <laughs> Me? Yeah. Oh, no. <laughs> oh, no. No, but I want... <gasps> no! No! <laughs> no! <laughs> Alice says I'd give anything a go once. Yeah, but do you tend to find yourself getting addicted to things? Because if so, then this is the kind of thing you wouldn't only have to try once. <laughs> I'm I'm like a drug dealer. <laughs> you know, if I use coarse words in the process of employing a different word, it doesn't count as using a coarse word, does it? Well, I'm, I'm I'd be like. A dealer, except what I'd be dealing wouldn't be cocaine. It'd be cocaine. <laughs> <laughs> first, first shots free. <laughs> oh gosh, honestly. I've, see, because I'm just trying to think. I don't want. I don't want to be too coarse for the viewers. I mean, I wouldn't want people to think that we're just a channel of dirty people. Yeah, but no, don't want people to think that. Ooh, springy. Ooh, now I'm stuck. 
Go on, Rob. I don't know how I got past that. Addicted. <laughs> It just says to me that somebody wants to send me a message on Instagram. Yeah. Do you remember that message that we got to participate in? Uh, somebody wanted to offer us, like, to become part of their team for like a brand thing. Can you remember? No. They thought we'd be a great fit. Well, um, for. Um, it was oh, called, I'm sure, the, the nut shaver. yeah, that literally one. it was called Pimp My Balls, and it was honestly like, testicle grooming. Yeah, boy. I like mine big and airy. Remind me of. They remind me of like three quarter scale coconuts. Rav. I'm only joking. More like peaches, you know, that, that nice little fluff that you get on peaches. Yeah. Right, I'm just looking at my Funko Pops, and I, I, I want to ask a question. Who's your favourite Disney princess? Nala. Yeah. I mean, I know you know who my favourite Disney princess is. What about everybody else in chat? Who's your favourite Disney princess? The only reason why I said Nala is because I don't really know. Well, I, I know a little bit about some of them. And I just think they're bad examples. Bad examples? Like, why? Well, Sleeping Beauty, when you think about it, you know... Basically, it implies that sexual assault is okay. So when you think, he, he, the prince goes and he's told, you know, find this princess and kiss her to wake her up. Now look, wait, she's asleep. It, it's not consent. I'm the same as Hayley, mine's Ariel. Alice in, I, Alice in Wonderland, if you think about it, right, is teaching people that basically to, to pick up random bits of food and stuff that you find on the floor anywhere, taking drugs, you know. Go on, go on, go on. No worries, Hayley. You go enjoy your pizza. <gasps> we'll see you soon. 
And we all know that Snow White was a whore. You try and tell me that she was living with, with that many little airy men. <laughs> and I will get in some. Exactly. I mean, that was digging up gold and diamonds for her. And that wasn't saying, you know, if you want this, you got to get down there. Well, true. Exactly. Plus, I've seen the Ramstein video. Well, yeah, and me. So I, I know these things. Rob, have you got the stream on, on the chat, by the way? Because I want your opinion on something. I really don't know. Why? Could you just open it so you can have a look at something on the stream for me? Have a look at something? Yeah, yeah. Let me know when you when you've loaded it. I've loaded it, yeah. You see that butterfly? Do you think it's worth it? Because oh. I do want costumes, but I don't want them costumes. That's why you're playing, isn't it? Yeah, but I like it. It's cute. So I don't know what to do. I don't know whether to actually buy it or leave it. That would be a really good idea. Leave it. Okay. Well, I was going to say, if you just make your own damn mind up for a change. Oh. <laughs> I'm ready whenever you are, anyway, so. Oh, that was a bit loud. Is that your phone? Yes. Yes. Right. Has anybody else got any more of this or that questions? Um, I'll have a think. I'm not sure. If anybody does have any this or that questions, it would be good. It, it like we would enjoy answering them. Hit parade. Say, I, I want like the weirder, the better kind of questions. Like, as an example, would you rather be? I'll, I'll ask you, Nikki. Would you rather be woke up every morning by being hit in the face by a horse's penis, or have to eat a raw onion every day for the rest of your life? Does raw onion count as pickled? Well, no, because then it's not technically a raw onion, is it? I think I'd take the onion. Good choice. <laughs> 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 Sorry, what do you say, Rob? Nothing, nothing more. Green Knight says he's just got back and all he heard was Rob say, get hit by a horse's penis. 
<laughs> Rob asked me, you know, like the this or that questions that you've been asking, if I would rather get hit by a horse's penis every morning or if I would rather eat a raw onion every day. Well, I said the onion. Your this or that questions was pretty good. Have you got any others for us? Great banana. Where are you? I'm over here. <laughs> right, if I stay on banana and you on grape. Yeah. Was he trying to push you off? Grape. Apple cherry. Is he trying to push you off there? Apple, orange. Watermelon banana. You would do that one. If Green Knight says a raw onion, then yes, horse's penis it is, lol. <laughs> <laughs> I think it'd be a bit weird, wouldn't it? You know, with the penis. <laughs> Why am I saying it? <laughs> I mean, I think I would prefer the onion. In some ways, but at the same time, I mean, it was only, it's only one slap a day. One slap a day? Yeah. What was I now now then? So I can see the logic for that. I think I'd still prefer the onion. Because I mean, you know I don't like onion. Only like, if it's pickled. I will, I'll have a look at that one in a second, Green Knight. I will be back. Oh, uh, hello, there's you, Rue. qualified green knight says however what if the horse's penis stank like an onion mm. you know 
you could you could have a shower and deodorant. True. And then we have: Would you rather have a pause button or a rewind button, and why? You mean like for life? I was going to say, do we get to move around? Like if we pause it? For your life events? <laughs> Honestly, for me... I mean, it's, it's a weird one for me, because, in theory, I would actually say, like, rewind. I mean, in reality, like, I don't really regret things that I've done, even if they've ended up bad. Yeah. Because I do believe that I've always done things with the most honest of intentions even if other people have not seen that um, and I believe that everything happens for a reason but yeah. in theory I think with me I'm a kind of I'm, I'm too impulsive for my own good so even if I even if I'd got a pause button I'd still use the same logic to convince myself hey this is a good idea yeah. So, probably rewind would be better. I've got to be honest, I would pick pause because think of basically, you could pause the, like your life. You can still move around. Get all your housework done. And then unpause and you, then you've got the whole day to do whatever you want to do. And I like the sound of that. Wow, that started off really well then. Eh? Yeah, but have you thought about the other implications? What's that? You can do things, see if they're a good idea. A bit like that idiot there, like, I think it's a good idea to say to him. Mate, I hope that somebody gives you a lobotomy while you're still awake. <laughs> I hope your granny poops in an envelope for your birthday. <laughs> think about it, you could like With a rewind button, think about the things that you could actually do. True. I mean, with the pause, I was thinking more of like just doing like your little jobs in the house. Like, if you've got to go to the shops or anything like that, that's still like. Um, use in real life like if it's just like you washing up uh, your laundry and stuff like that you can do that with the pause button no that was bad 
I would have been okay there if I would have uh, landed on the next level down instead of dropping right to the bottom. Um, yeah, well, I mean, I'm thinking like, you know, like, if with a rewind button you would have still actively have had to have done things. So you would get the experience of doing something. Then you'd be able to rewind and get that experience again. I suppose. So it's like... Or, I mean, how many times do you get so frustrated with yourself because you've been doing something and then just one silly decision that you've made has completely affected the outcome or something? Yeah, like like a little bit of take you back a little bit and you can fix it. Yeah. Oh, thank you for coming back, Hayley. We're glad you're and, still here, honestly. And, and you're thinking small term as well, I mean. Think of the bigger picture. You could become a millionaire. You could become a millionaire so easily. Because think about it like... <laughs> the outcome of, say, gambling won't yeah. change. So, for example, go to your local betting shop. Play, say, place a large bet. Or even just a small bet on, say... Roulette. Yeah. <clears throat> Remember the outcome. I think go back. First, first time, and then put a large bet on everything that gives the biggest payouts. You know, like every single sports match you can possibly bet on. Yeah. <clears throat> find out the results at the end of the day. Go back. The lottery. Find out what the numbers are. Reverse time. Do, do that weekly and then the good thing about that is think of how much money you could end up saving and how much good you can do for people with it well, that's true that is true plus green knights just said if you want pause like if you move stuff and then you want pause they'll move at like sort of dramatic speed so then the cup that you've just washed up could be deadly so yeah, I think I'll probably go for the for the rewind button then instead. I don't want a deadly cop. Well, I uh, I stuff that one up. Well done. Oh, you didn't get sorry. Why did I just say well done? I'm sorry. Bad luck. Bad luck. I got through, but bad luck. Yeah, I, I, I wasn't paying attention to what I was doing properly, was I? But like I say, for, for me, I think it'd be for that for that reason would be the best. Like, you could, I mean, think about it. All you know, the times when there's these, you know, hundred and twenty-eight million pound jackpot. Yeah. You know, and then think about it. You could like, if he was the sole winner of that, you could down. You could pick like. How many charities, for example, and donate money to how many charities? You could find, you could find, um, you know, uh, you could you could buy like um, a large sort of ground, like barren ground area in places, and set up. Like get get places to be built to set up like cheap sustainable housing for like homeless people. Yeah. But you wouldn't be able to do that with pausing because pausing you'd only be able to pause at the outcome. With with which case you've already had to have made your bet. So I I reckon rewind.
I have no idea why I just walked into that. There's just one downside to it. What's that? It'll never happen. I'll read that in a second, sorry. Well done. Thank you. Wow. Well, that's, I'll say, you said well done, so I'll say thank you to you. Oh, yeah. Uh, well, you said I'll read that in a second. No one oh, yeah, yeah. Um, Green Knight says, what about if taking the, the lottery back... You change your numbers to the winning numbers, and then somebody could have won it. Like, who, who needed it, kind of thing. And we've just made them lose. Well then, because it, 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 the jackpot will be split. That's the good thing about it, because the jack, they'll that, still get the jackpot. We'll just be split between them that was gonna win it and myself. So you, although you're reducing the the winnings that that would get, you're not taking it off them completely. So the people who could possibly need it would be getting it, but also other people that would need it will also benefit from it by you know, somebody having it to try and help out other people. Yeah. <laughs> well, now I'm about to lose and I Point being, if you ask me, is people who could do with winning the lottery for whatever reason. No, 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 no! Oh. Never tend to be the ones I'm lucky enough to. I mean, like, like I was re I was seeing. Like a news story about that one idiot that did you see her? She like she won. I think it was nineteen million. Yeah. And she's now bankrupt. Really. Because mm -hmm. she spent it on a lot of expensive things, and you know, lost a good lot of it like that. But then didn't realise that there were certain taxes and and such. Yeah. I mean, the money itself is tax free, but there's a wealth tax there. Yeah. Um. So whenever we had to blow at least like two thirds of it on things like that. Some of it on parties and stuff, and some of it on tax that she didn't realise she got to pay. Oh yeah, yeah. Hang on, one second. Did you make it through? You didn't, did you? No. <laughs> but I think the thing is, it's like honestly, same highly. I wish we could be awesome. What? Win the lottery. You know you know what the thing is for me? What's that? I think in some ways I would say yeah, it'd be it'd be good. It'd be good to win the lottery.
put your mouse on then I actually think that part of it could stop you from being so humble well yeah because I think for me personally I feel like A lot of the time, when you've got nothing, or when you've had nothing, more so when you've actively got nothing, you, you appreciate more what you do have. And I think if you've been in that situation and then you've just got a load of money, it's easy to forget what it's like to have none because you get so wrapped up then in what you have then got that you forget what it's like to not have it yeah and you try desperately to make up for everything that you never had that you wish you had and then It doesn't really make you happy. We would definitely share the money if we won the lottery, honestly. So I think when I think it was like when we did have that bit of money, I wasted it. And I wish I hadn't. So now I think it's like... You'd like to think you wouldn't make the same mistake of wasting the thing. Do you know, do you know what I mean? Yeah, well, the thing for me is... I mean... You know, not talking about like what I've done and oh look, I'm so great. But long story short, there was a time when we both had basically a grand just to spend on whatever we wanted, just just for ourselves. Um. And yeah, I did. I did get myself something. I could pretend I didn't. I bought myself a new PlayStation control because the one that I'd got was broke. Like the stick was broken. The battery wasn't running that well. Yeah. <laughs> and I'm and. The, the newest Pokemon game that was out at the time. <laughs> the rest of it I spent on buying my dad a PlayStation, my mom a camera, and giving 200, was it? £200 to people at my workplace because they was raising money for a plaque for one of the workers sons that had died because the, the, that day it was like it, it was £250 they needed for like a plaque for the Birmingham Ch Children's Hospital and then all that money they put the plaque up in the ward to commemorate him and all the rest of the money would just go to the hospital and um, £200 to a friend that was struggling with keeping a business afloat yeah and do you want to know something <laughs> if I had the money I'd do the same again except yeah. instead of it being £200 if I'd got like millions, it'd be 200,000 or 20 grand or 
I'd end up just giving it all away. I gotta be honest see, there's been times where Rob's had birthday money like off my nan. You know, people like that. And he spent it on everybody else. He hasn't bought anything for himself. So I feel selfish for doing it. That's why. And I, I agree, by the way. Um, <laughs> if it's not like, like say, the main focus of of your life, you'll be all right. Why is it turning my camera around? I'm literally gonna punch somebody in a minute. I mean, while, while you carry on getting angry, I mean, I will say, with what you were just on about, like... I don't mean sound... It don't mean sound like a cliche, but when you think about it... And I, I hate to say this because I, I, I sometimes I think I could say this and obviously it could sound funny to, to you because of the accident that dad had when I was a kid that stopped him being able to work. Yeah. There, there was so much like help for disabled people back then, was there? No. You still did get the help, but they didn't. There wasn't as much active help for people. So looking at it, I mean, technically, I come, um, I come from a poor, a poorer background. But first of all, there's the obvious point of. A poorer background, but I still had more than what the some kids in the world that I've got. Well, I think that's the thing, isn't it? Right. Heidi says I loves buying people things as well. Yeah. You know, I, I spent all the money on everybody. Yeah, we've definitely noticed. <laughs> Heidi, Heidi, it's naughty of you. Greatly appreciated, but yeah, you're naughty. You know, you're naughty. And Green Knight says, here's another, would you rather s someone see your photos on your phone or read through all your text messages, including any photo that you've sent? Oh. <coughs> the, I think this would be more one for you, to be honest, Nikki, because I'm easy on either way. Do I read any pictures of myself? Because, uh, well, there's multiple reasons why I, I hate my picture being took. So I don't really take any pictures of myself. So I've got no embarrassing pictures or anything. Mo In fact, most of my pictures am <laughs> I'm a fudge. Damn. Well, then. Uh, there's, 
as far as like the, the reading the text messages, I, I never put anything to people in messages that I wouldn't be willing to say for real. Precisely, I th yeah. <laughs> so I, I'm honestly happy with, with either, really. I think Pinky should know that. I mean, when I was when I was trying to tell her about my my thick fingers. Oh gosh. <laughs> <laughs> and trying to get her to tell her mum about him. <laughs> yeah, is he, hold on, is Pinky still here? Yes, Pinky's here. It yeah, says none of your big deck rub. <laughs> You're saying that now, you wouldn't be saying that if I was there. <laughs> no, what? See, see that the reason, I know Pinky realises the reason why I was telling her as well was because you shouted at me because of my ring size. Yeah. Seriously, what you're trying to look at things for us to get married, and literally it needs an, the largest ring size well, plus man. about three extra. Well done. <laughs> Ailey said, oh, when you pretended to be Nikki asking to see my boobs. <laughs> yeah, that's because I'd asked you myself and you were saying that. <laughs> I thought and then maybe, it... you know, you might, as women, tell each other, like, you know, I've got this, this mark on my chest. Do you think it's anything? You know, just <laughs> trying to get a bit of... Yeah. Booby familiarity. <laughs> well, then I said, got a big ring rub. And then said, send me a pic of your fingers rub. Well, did, did Nikki send you that picture of, of a with her hand on top of mine? I did. You took, yeah, well. What, what, can, what do you expect though? It's bass player fingers, isn't it? I said, I, sp I suppose, what would you expect? It's bass player's fingers. I mean, Honestly, I there's sometimes I feel like, you know, I'm so tiny. Like, compared to. Compared to Rob, like say he's six foot four and I'm five foot two. <laughs> I'm sure it will be John Inns. <laughs> he says he believes a diamond covered wee wee ring is probably expensive too. But then he says, actually, I've no idea what conversation I've just walked into. He's just saying. <laughs> <laughs> Well, good I guess as any. A bit, a bit off, but... Oh, you bum hole. Well done. That's the first time I've qualified in that round, you know. Yeah. We will have to leave once Rob's finished this one. I didn't actually realise it's nearly quarter past five. He is, yeah, he's six foot four. <laughs> and I'm the tiny five foot two. Oh! <laughs> I prefer the shorter women, you see. That make my penis look bigger. <laughs> Alice just said, well, if his fingers are Z plus three, F knows what his willy is. Well, does do I say something like a, a, a bloke's piece is supposed to be about as big as his hand span? And my hand span's like probably one and a half, one and three quarter PlayStation controllers. Oh gosh. 
I think I think Hailey means more of round, seeing as like your round fingers. I really failed that part. Oh well. Uh... Oh, you failed. Oh. Yeah. Never mind. Would it be fair to say like? Maybe a Pepsi bottle. A Pepsi bottle. Give or take. I don't mean like the big ones. I mean like you know the the five hundred mil ones. Crap. I'm not, I'm not a bragger. <laughs> what do you mean, crap? You've had it in you enough, so you should know. <laughs> Ailey said, poor Nicky. <laughs> Green Knight said, wait, what about a Pepsi bottle? <laughs> you don't want to know. You probably do, actually, as soon as you liked his ASMR. <laughs> well, I'm just going to say, I've always been told I'm a bit of a handful. He kind of does. <laughs> Right, I, I'm just going to check if the person that I saw earlier that I wanted to raid is online still. I think she is, because I think she's, st she's streaming for 12 hours today. <laughs> Alice just says that's so thick is Richard, but not Richard is. <clears throat> Yeah, but I, I don't want to brag, so I'm just... I'm trying to actually make it seem just... as average size as I can. Average? <laughs> Honestly, Rob. <laughs> Green Note says, Rob kinda thick, LMAO. <laughs> like, you know... What is it with the two C's? I, 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 I'm not with, like, down with the kids much anymore, so I'm not really sure what the difference is, like, adding the second C. No, Nick, so. Nicky's not down with the kids anymore. She had enough of that when she took advantage of me when I was underage. Brab. Right, yeah, she's still online. She grabbed onto it and she started beating it like she was whipping cream. Rob! <laughs> so, yeah, what we're going to do, we're going to raid um, Scouty Games. Now, Scout, she, um, she's doing a charity stream at the minute, so I thought something... The more C's, the more voluptuous the booty is. Oh, I get it. Ah, oh, okay. Well, I need a whole alphabet of C's then. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, so I'll pop the ride on for Scout. Like I said, she's doing a charity stream at the minute, so she's playing a lot of different games. I'm not sure what she's playing at the minute. It says, tell me why. I'm not sure. She plays Bio. By our mutant, she plays different things, so I'll pop that raid on. Raid Scouty Games. Okay. Johnin says, or in this case, Rob's wee wee with the more voluptuous the stuff. Well, I mean. Yeah, I mean, the point is, people think it's easy. People think it's easy being, should we say, so penally voluptuous, voluptuous even. Oh gosh. I mean, you, you don't realise. I mean, you know, last time I went to the zoo, they actually people was following me about with an, a net and a box. I thought one of the snakes had escaped. Oh gosh, Ruff. <laughs> 
And, you know, it's it's harassment. It's harassment, honestly. Right, I'm popping this raid on, so let me say goodbye to everybody. I went to the Jungle Book premiere and said, look, they've even got car. Johnin said, it's like the Loch Ness Monster wrote. Yeah, in terms of, it's completely fictional. <laughs> I'm just trying to make myself feel better. <laughs> oh, bless you. Right, oh, I'll pop the raid on. So, yeah, thank you, everybody, for staying in and having a chat. We've really enjoyed today again. <laughs> Ailey said Python. <laughs> um, oh, yeah. <clears throat> Green Knight said Rob is proud. <laughs> yeah, but it's because of all, all Pinky's dirty talk. It's, it's, just, it's just made it that way. Okay. <laughs> thank you for staying, and we really appreciate you all chatting. And I'm not sure... Um, Ash is here anymore but if she is thank you for the sub again I hope everybody has a good day or night or wherever you are in the world so and um, Rob will be streaming Thursday we're not sure what yet so we'll let you know so I'll send the raid now bye everybody you just say bye Rob bye Rob no I'll just say bye everyone Bye, everyone. <laughs> okay. Bye. What? Goodbye. What was that? Goodbye. <laughs> ASMR rub. <laughs> bye. Hayley said bye, my panda. Yeah, bye, Pinky. <laughs>